7 to 10. The followers brought the donkey to Jesus. They put their coats on it, and Jesus sat on it. Many people spread their coats on the road for Jesus. Others cut branches in the fields and spread the branches on the road. Some of them were walking ahead of Jesus. Others were walking behind him. Everyone shouted, Hosanna! Welcome! God bless the one who comes in the name of the Lord. God bless the kingdom of our father David. That kingdom is coming. Hosanna to God in heaven. Jesus was in Bethany at the house of Simon the leper. While he was eating there, a woman came to him. She had an alabaster jar filled with expensive perfume made out of pure nard. She opened the jar and poured the perfume on Jesus' head. This woman did the only thing she could do for me. She, per she poured perfume on my body before I died to prepare it for burial. The good news will be told to people all over the world, and I can assure you that everywhere the good news is told. The story of what this woman did the story of what this woman did will also be told and people will remember her. Mark 14, 10-11 Then Judas Iscariot, one of the twelve apostles, went to talk to the leading priests about handing Jesus over to them. They were very happy about this and they promised to pay him, so he waited for the best time to hand Jesus over to them. While they were eating, Jesus took some bread and thanked God for it. He broke off some pieces, gave it to his followers, Can and said, Take no, and eat this bread. It is from my body. No, it is my body. 23. Oh. <laughs> then he mm -hmm. took a cup of wine, thanked God for it, and gave it to them. Then they all drank from the cup. Mark 14, verse 32 to 36. Jesus and his followers went to a place named Gethsemane. He said to them, Sit here while I pray. But he told Peter, James, and John to come with him. He began to be very distressed and troubled, and he said to them, My heart is so heavy with grief, I feel as if I am dying. Wait here and stay awake. Jesus went a little farther from them, fell to the ground, and prayed. He asked that, if possible, he would not have this time of suffering. He said, Abba, Father, you can do all things. Don't make me drink from this cup, but do what you want, not what I want. Forty-four. Ju Judas planned to do something to show them which one was Jesus. He said, the one I kiss will be Jesus. Arrest him and guard him while you lead him away. So Judas went over to Jesus and said, Teacher, then kissed him. The men grabbed Jesus and arrested him. While Peter was still in the yard, a servant girl of the highest priest came there. She saw him warming himself by the fire. She looked closely at him and said, you are Jesus, the man from Nazareth. But Peter said that was not true. That makes no sense, he said. I don't know what you're talking about. Then he left and went to the entrance of the yard and a rooster crowed. When the girl, servant girl saw him there, she began saying again to the people standing around, This man is one of them. Again Peter said it was not true. A short time later, the people standing there said, we know you are one of them because you are from Galilee. Then Peter began to curse. He said, I swear to God, I don't know this man you're talking about. As soon as Peter said this, the rooster crowed the second time. Then he remembered what Jesus had told him. Before the rooster crows twice, you will say three times that you do not know me. Then Peter began to cry. Pilate's soldiers took Jesus into the governor's palace. They called 
all the other soldiers together. They put a purple robe on Jesus, made a crown from thorny branches, and put it on his head. Then they began shouting, Welcome, King of the Jews. They kept on beating him with a stick and spitting on him. Then they bowed down on, on their knees and pretended to honor him as a king. After they finished making fun of him, they took off the robe and put his own clothes on again, on him again. Then they led him out of the palace to be killed on the cross. Mark 15, 21 to 24. There was a man from Cyrene named Simon walking into the city from the fields. He was the father of Alexander and Rufus. The soldiers forced him to carry Jesus' cross. They led Jesus to the place called Golgotha. Golgotha means the place of the skull. There they gave him some wine mixed with mirror, but he refused to drink it. The soldiers nailed Jesus to a cross. Mark 15 verse 24. Then they divided his clothes among themselves, throwing dice to see who would get what. Mark 15, 33-37 At noon the whole country became dark. This darkness continued until 3 o'clock. At 3 o'clock, Jesus cried out loudly, Eloi, 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 Lama, Sabathachi. This means, my God, my God, why have you left me alone? Some of the people standing there heard this. They said, listen, he is calling, Elijah. One man there ran and got a sponge. He filled the sponge with sour wine and tied it to his stick. Then he used the stick to give the sponge to Jesus and get a drink from it. Then the man said, we should wait now and see if Elijah will come and take him down from the cross. Then Jesus, cr then Jesus cried out loudly and died. Joseph brought some linen cloth. He took the body from the cross, wrapped it in the linen, and put the body in a tomb that was dug in, the, in a wall of rock. Then he closed the tomb by rolling a large stone to cover the entrance. The next day after the Sabbath, Mary Magdalene, Salome, and Mary the mother of James brought some sweet-smelling spices to put on Jesus' body. Very early on that day, the first day of the week, the women were going to the tomb. It was very early after sunrise. The women said to each other, There's a large stone covering the entrance of the tomb. Who will move the stone for us? Then the women looked and saw that the stone was moved. The stone was very large, but it was moved away from the entrance. The, mo the women walked into the tomb and saw a young man, they were wearing a white robe. He was sitting on the right side of the tomb. The women were afraid. But the man said, Do not be afraid. You are looking for Jesus from Nazareth, the one who was killed on the cross. He is risen. He is risen! 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 He is risen!